Welcome back to the final part of the series. In the previous parts, we've learned how to perform document check, workplace inspection, and personnel interviews. We've also learned how to total up and calculate the scores for each of the components. Now that we've obtained the scores for document check, workplace inspection, and personnel interview, it's time to put them together to find the overall chassis score. All you have to do now is to add these scores together, and the total would be the chassis score. Looks like the site that we assessed got a score of 87.5%. Refer to the star ranking table to find out how well the site has performed in the assessment. 87.5% sits here, so the site earns a 4-star ranking. This means that the site has been doing a very good job from an OSH perspective, but it's not excellent yet. There's still room for improvement in the future. But if a site gets a score of 49% and below, sadly, the site has failed to meet the minimum OSH requirements. Want to be a chassis assessor? Well, let me show you how. A chassis assessor is a person who is appointed and possesses any of these qualifications. A person who has attended a one-day chassis course and passed the examination and have a minimum of five years' experience in the construction industry. Or, a person who has attended a one-day chassis course and certified as an OSH lead auditor with a minimum of three years' experience in the construction industry, specifically in construction project site. Or, an SHO or triple S who has a valid registration with DOSH and CIDB. So, if you're really interested to become a chassis assessor after this, make sure you study the CIS thoroughly and pass the exam, okay? Want to get some tips for your exams? I've got some questions that you might find useful. I suggest you pause the video after each question and try to figure out the answer before viewing the solutions.
Congratulations! You have successfully sat through the entire series. You're on your way to becoming a chassis assessor, I hope. Feel free to screen through any of the videos again at your own pace. Be sure to study the CIS, especially the Assessor Guide. I would strongly advise you to also read up on the relevant regulations and standards. When you're confident already, contact our administrator for the chassis examination. Good luck!